Hello everyone and welcome back to Carrie's Beauty Corner. It's been a minute. <laughs> um, I um, had to take a little break and this is probably going to be the most difficult video that I've ever recorded. Um, but I'm just going to give you a little life update and tell you where I've been and um, if you'd like to see this through to the end, then keep on watching. I'll be right back. Okay. Um, I'm not going to talk about the makeup that I'm using specifically. I'm just going to put some makeup on and talk to you a little bit about what's been going on in my life and um, I had already decided that November was going to be no new makeup November so I'm not making any purchases just in preparation for the holidays um, so I'm just going to use some of the makeup that I have and dig in here and we're just gonna talk. Whoa, that didn't start off too well. Um, let me just start by saying that I've thought about this and I've prayed about it. Um, and the conclusion that I came to was that I don't believe I could do her any justice. And by her, um, I mean my granddaughter, Riley. Um, my husband and I lost her in a tragic accident. Um, she would have been three years old in December. Um, there, there is so much that I could say about her, but I don't think that I could do her justice. You would have had to have known her um, to appreciate her. Um, I want to show you a few pictures of her because there's probably never been a more beautiful child. Um, and we are tasked with learning to live this life without her and it's going to be a very difficult thing to do but we loved her and we miss her and that's all i'm going to say There's no rule book on grief. I believe everybody um, grieves in their own way um, because certain people come in and out of our lives for, you know, for whatever reason, they come in and out of our lives and um, it's hard excuse me, it's hard sometimes to know the role that they play. And it seems like Riley's role was just making people happy. That's what she did. And so with that being said, um, as hard as I thought about giving up my channel and stopping this, because I just couldn't seem to want to get in front of the camera. Um, 
I decided that, you know, I needed to. I needed to um, go on because I do have a passion for makeup and skincare, and I've enjoyed this channel so far. I've enjoyed it so much, and giving up is just. I don't know it doesn't it just doesn't feel right it, it doesn't feel um, like something that I want to do so, so I'm going to continue no new November um, I may not be able to get to my three videos a week I'm gonna play that by ear but I will keep you posted um, I have a new account on parlor that I'm going to list below. Um, I'm kind of like a lot of other people. I'm about to get fed up with Facebook and some of their um, censorship ideas. I don't really care for that. Um, but anyway, I think the best way to honor um, my beautiful granddaughter is to just keep going and um, just dedicate it to her. Um, she just was, she just, see I can't do it, I'm praying and the words aren't coming. Anyway, I just really feel um, like I need to keep going. So, here we go. Um, I think I'm going to probably film a little bit late, but I'm gonna film some, uh, some of my October favorites. And um, the rest of the month, we're just gonna play with what we have. So, if there's anything in particular that you guys would like to see, let me know in the comments below, and I'll see if I can't get to that and um, and bring you what you want to see. So, questions. Who has already got their Christmas tree up? I cannot believe the number of people that I have seen on social media who already have their trees up and their houses decorated. Um, I think it's awesome, but it's even, I, I, you, you don't come much more Kringle than me. Uh, I, I am a Christmas person, but it's even a little bit too early for me. Um, I'm just not quite ready. And uh, I'm definitely not quite ready to, to get into, um, making purchases and figuring out what what I want to do for people. I'm not, I'm not ready for that. And I mean, I know I better get ready for it pretty soon, but I'm not there yet. Um, so anyway, that'll be, that'll be next. Um, shopping, um, which I do most of my shopping online anyway. I'm, I'm not big on crowds and you know, just with COVID still playing its ugly part and, um, you know, just kind of feeling a little bit antisocial. I'm sure we'll do most of our shopping online, um, which I don't mind. I don't mind that at all because you never know when you buy something for somebody if it's going to work for them anyway. So, it's just as, uh, just as easy to do it that way. And y'all, I'm just doing a little simple look. I'm just trying to keep my hands busy while I talk to you and and tell you a bit about, you know, what's been going on. Uh, let's see what else is new around here. One thing I, I'm not going to talk about, I'm not going to talk about, um, I'm not gonna talk about the election. We're not gonna get into all that, um, but really, um, other than the holidays coming up, um, there's just not a whole lot else going on. Um, our youngest daughter, um, 
is getting married on the 28th, and that's going to be a very beautiful wedding. I'm looking forward to that. She's going to be a beautiful bride. We had a, a little shower for her yesterday, um, which was just was really neat. It's 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 difficult for everyone right now just because of the circumstances, but you know we have to find the joy in life and if it's not something that's right in front of your face i really do think that the lord calls us to to find the joy to find um a way to to honor those that are gone and to um celebrate with those of us that are still here um I'm gonna do a real simple look. So I think I'm just going to go in with this, um, give them La La palette and just just do something simple. I'm not really, not really in the mood to do a whole lot. So, anyway. I think I'll, uh, I think I'll just zip through this part and feeling, feeling like I've said enough for a moment. probably going to go down in history as my worst video ever and I didn't I didn't want that to be the case but I'm just I just I can't seem to find the words right now um, I know they'll come in time um, but I really really hope that in this life People do choose kindness because you can't tell by looking at someone what they might be going through. And I believe that we all
are burdened. Whether it be mentally, spiritually, uh, physically, and you really don't know what your neighbor might be going through. Um, so I say um, choose kindness. Um, I guess I can pull these clips out of my hair, not that it's gonna help a whole lot, but it is what it is. Not gonna make a tremendous amount of effort today. Um, it's Sunday. Um, I think my husband and I are just gonna have a laid back day. Um, so anyway, I thank you so much as always for joining me. Um, I hope you'll say a little prayer for some people who are hurting. Um, if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, hit that below give this video a like and stick with me because I'll be back with something maybe a little more uplifting than this. Um, anyway, as always, God bless and thank you for being here.